how much of our overall, I guess, lifespan is dictated by the genes that we have versus things that we could control through the various behaviors that you mentioned, like not smoking and eating well, and then potentially some of these other therapeutics and innovations that become available over time. The low end, if you do the maths in one way, you can get 5% of your lifespan is determined genetically. And at the higher end, if you do the maths in a slightly different way, it's something like 20, 25%. And what that means is that somewhere between 75 and 95% of how long you live is determined by two things. One of them is lifestyle and the other one is just luck. But then if you look at the people who live incredibly long lives, people who make it into their 90s, their hundreds or even the 110s, these centenarians and super centenarians as they're called, that does seem to run in families to a much greater extent. So if you've got a parent or a sibling who made it to 100, your chances of doing it yourself are 10 times greater than people in the general population. 